What's up, Cold Water Nation? It's Jeff. Today, we're back out at the Tiger Trout Pond. Um, we're back over the culvert where we've had a whole bunch of luck this year. And right now, just getting my rig all pulled together. But given that today is a very cold 55 degree and very windy day, we're gonna be throwing around a float with a couple uh, nymphs hanging off of it. We're gonna do a double nymph rig today um, just to start and we'll see what happens. We'll see what, see if any of the weather changes. It looks like there's good weather coming on the horizon so that might, uh, wind might knock off by then. The wind's blowing my way. But uh, hopefully we'll have a, a good fishing day today. Let's not get caught up in my gear. <laughs> Um, hopefully we'll have a good fishing day today. Uh, yesterday we got two really nice trout. That was probably the video before this. So uh, hoping to get a few more today. Be awesome. So hopefully we can uh, get lucky here. Once we get all set up, take a couple casts and see what happens. And I'll see you guys uh, when I get everything pulled together. Fish! Nope. <laughs> you didn't get very far, did you? Is it brown? No way. Woo! Come on. He's tired now. Yeah! What's up, guys? My name's Brian. And I'm Jeff. And you're watching Empire Cold Water. Let's rip some lips. This video is brought to you in part by Upstate Excursions and by Black Dog Outdoor Sports. Oh, it's a perch. I've never caught one of these out of here. Okay. Hello there, little buddy. Oops, I'm sorry. Never caught a perch out of here. He's not supposed to be here. Let's not get you stabbing me. That'd be great. Would you kindly let go? All right, we're gonna run him over to where he belongs because he does not belong in here. Probably some bird picked him up and dropped him over there or something. But we're gonna go ahead and toss this guy into the water where he belongs, which is down there. <laughs> oh boy, gotta love it. Finding all sorts of fish that I'm not supposed to catch out of here today. I feel like I'm doing my own fishing conservation thing, which is really annoying. <laughs> Another one of these damn perch. Huh, seen a muscle run into a whole school of them. Cool. 
Well, we all know where he goes, so let's run him over there. So you certainly don't belong here. Cleaning out a population. Run this perch over to where it belongs. See you later, buddy. Oof. Two nice sized perch back to back. Conservation. <laughs> Cleaning out the species that don't belong here. Because they eat all the trout eggs and it makes it impossible for these guys to breed effectively there's also a problem with the panfish for bastards all righty getting in some cardio today Trout, looks like. Yep, finally got one. Rainbow. Nope, brown. It's a brown. It looked like a rainbow, but it was not. Yep. Baby brown though. Hey buddy, you wanna stop? I'm trying to get the fly out of your face. All right, I gotta switch hands with you. Get off my needle nose. No, stop, stop. There we go. Geez, that took a lot to get off. Hi, Easton. You wanna let this one go? Come on, you wanna let this fish go? No, I don't keep fish, buddy. If your dad catches one, you can keep it. Come on, buddy. There we go. And away he goes. There you go. Two in a row. Trout. Another yep, another brownie. You want my other squirmy? <laughs> oh, this is a baby. 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 He's just fighting me really good.
It's a tiger. Oh, is it? Yep. Come here, buddy. Oh, that is a baby. that right to the upper lip though. Mm-hmm. Well, because I also am uh, very active at setting the hook. This is a female. I tossed the beetle. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised if that got hit. That was quick too. Yep, yeah, as soon as it sank down there. Well, okay, I guess she wanted to go. Made her, got her into the water before she... Uh, Holy crap. That rainbow was just four feet in the air. Ah, I'm not catching them. <laughs> Dude, that thing had to have been like this. You want my other squirmy? Yeah. It's ex tied exactly the same way. It's just really injured. <laughs> well, this is the one that had a steel head in its mouth. You can yeah. see the top's a little mm -hmm. shredded. Hmm. But... I guess I gotta tie more of those. <laughs> well, heck, even if the top part falls off, I think they'll still eat it regardless. Apparently, they keep chewing it on the middle. Oh, so they keep scrunching right up in the center then. Yep. What are you running, that same depth still? Yep. Hmm. That was on the down. It, it wasn't even finished sinking and just got yanked under. Plus, they're also, they're not hitting it super hard. They're ticking it. Hmm. They're like grabbing it and then tentatively letting it go. I wonder if it's an investigation grab. I think that might be it, but I'll take investigation grabs over not catching any fish. That's two so far and two calves. Careful. Careful, man. That had to hurt. <laughs> That's why you don't run your mouth and walk on rocks. What? Little pan. Are you? Stop destroying my flies. You guys have too many sharp fins. You guys are like little weaponized monsters. See you later, buddy. Wow, he barely made it. Just hit the water, you jack. Box. Let a trout get it. Greedy little freaking bluegill. Jesus Christmas. What is it with you guys and choking them? <laughs> what is it with you guys and choking flies? I don't have too many elk hair caddies left, you jack. Ah.
Ow. Thanks. I wanted that spine. Another choker. God damn it. At least this guy was in the front of the mouth. I don't have to... Well, you made a nice sound. Another little pan. Of course you got this wedged right in the gap of the soft part of your mouth. Mm. There we go. See you later. Well guys, uh, I did not expect this to happen, but I was just throwing around my caddis and uh, I got a tiger. So let's see if we can get him in a net. Very decent tiger. Get this off of that, my net. Very good tiger. Whew, lots of energy. Guys have been feeding well on the uh, the bait fish that have come out of the rocks now, so I expect him to be, you know, decently heavy. Come on, got a great hook set. Oh, joke, so close. Come on, fucking oh, got my line all snagged up on me. Right, let's see if we can get a little bit more line on him. Pull them real close. 
Oh, no, not too aggressively. This is gonna be a trick. Jesus Christmas, I'm falling over myself. Yes. There we go, we got them guys, we got them. Let's get our hands wet here a little bit. Try to get them unhooked as fast as possible. Beautiful tiger trout. Let's get you unhooked. Right in the corner of your mouth. Beautiful tiger trout, guys. Absolutely gorgeous. I love these fish. These guys fight so hard. You can see the kite, he's a male. He's ready to go. Let's let him go. See you later, buddy. Thank you very much. We hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like what you saw today, consider giving this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Thanks for hanging out with us, and we'll see you next time. Until then, tight, tight lines, lines everybody. everybody.